I wanted to recommend two really easy breathing exercises that can just alleviate stress, tension and anxiety immediately and you can do them any time of the day, either in the morning when you wake up and you want to kind of clear your head towards the new day, you can do it at your desk at work when you're stressed out, you can take a moment in the evening when you've finished working and kind of clear your head before you go and spend time with your family or you can do it at night before you go to bed. Nothing too holistic, too spiritual. If you're kind of not sure, you're not into that thing, just try it out once or twice and see how it makes you feel. Nothing to lose there. So we call it box breathing. That's the first exercise, which is basically imagining a box. Yeah. And each side of that box is a count of four. And so we start with a count of four, inhale, then a count of four, hold the breath, a count of four, exhale, and a count of four, hold the breath before you inhale again. Okay, so if you feel a bit of a hyper breathing, just exhale it all out and relax. And I'm going to just demonstrate and then maybe you can join me for a couple of those. So I'm going to inhale on one. Hold one. Exhale. And hold. If you want to join in, you can try now. Inhale. And hold for four. When you inhale, always try to inhale deep to your tummy. Exhale for four, either from your mouth or your nose. Either is fine. And hold. Now let's try to inhale a little bit lower and deeper to your tummy. And hold. Relax your facial muscles. Maybe smile. <laughs> Exhale. And hold again. Feel that lack of air and movement and then bring it in and hold and use that hold section to just release the muscles the shoulders the neck exhale good and that hold two three and that's it let's open our eyes so if you joined in i hope you enjoyed it you can do 10, 20 of those until you feel very relaxed. It does the work really quickly. For me, it's very effective. If the four count is too much, um, you can always do a three count. So just do one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, until you build it up to four. Ideally, that symmetrical four count puts all the thoughts away, you know, and relaxes and focuses you on what you're doing. So the second exercise is Kapalabhati, which means we're gonna put our hands on the tummy here and we're gonna exhale through the nose. As I exhale, you're gonna feel a little movement here around the diaphragm. It's like your tummy is getting punched in, okay? And that's what we're gonna try and do. I would suggest trying with 20 times. Um, don't go too fast, just make it really comfortable for yourself, it should be easy. Um, and what it does is that whole and that feeling punched in the tummy, it releases a lot of anger, it releases tension from the muscles. So while you do it, it's a very mechanical thing which enables you to let go of other things, okay? Let go of other muscles. So relax your shoulders, relax your face. So we're gonna try and do the Kapalabhati only for 20 times, okay? And see how you guys feel. And you can always make it longer later on. So let's do it trial, okay? Whew. Balance out your breathing first. Now we're gonna take a deep inhale. And for a count of 20. Relax your jaw. And go back to your normal breathing. Try to feel the sensation in your body if your eyes are still closed. If not, maybe close them. So see, I've only done 20, but I'm already feeling like the energy that was buzzing here from recording the video and getting excited and concentrating and explaining to you has kind of dropped down to about here. Um, I would try to do that like I said, when you get to about 50, 60 times, it sounds a lot, but it's not that much. And really see if that takes you deeper into a relaxed mode, maybe a more meditative mode. So try those out and I would really appreciate it if you let me know in the comments whether you know it was good, made you feel good, made you feel bad, you were confused, you're not sure how to do it, and I'll try to respond. And if you've got any suggestions, feel free to share them.